Hey guys, it's Geo back in a video. And today, I'm gonna be showing you all my tackle. Um, so yeah, let's get right into the video. These right here are all my tackle boxes. First off, we're gonna go with my um panfish tackle box right here. So I have some different size hooks here. They kind of mixed up because they slide through these. Um, but there's different hooks, two different things of sweatshops. I didn't need to get more of that size. I just got some new jig heads. Um, these are also some jig heads right here. Kind of like curved. I don't know. They're pretty weird. And these, I think, these are my size one um, beetle spins. And then these are my size zeros right here. And then here are some of my jigs. There's a black jig and a white jig. I do need to get some more black. And then I have some rooster tails. So this is black and white. And a bigger size, a uh, smaller size. These are um, red and like this blue color and orange. So that's my pan for stuff. Um, next, we're gonna go to um, bass tackle. Okay, guys. So we're gonna do bass tackle now. We're gonna start off with um, swim baits and like rattle traps and stuff. Uh, I don't have a separate box for them, and I just had this box, so I just put them in here. But I do need to get a swim bait box and like a rattle trap crankbait box soon. But here is this little sunfish paddle tail swim bait here. And then here's a bigger version. And then here is this red uh, lip plus. And then another red one right here. Kind of like different designs. This one's Strike King, I'm pretty sure. And um, this one's a Bass Pro band, brand. So. There's some teeth marks there. They're pretty nice bass. And then this, uh, like, shad swim bait here. Next. I got next, we're going to the top water. And then so first off, we got this Bass Pro uh, brand popper. And then we also have this bass for Ben Poppy. Have caught in like two fish on this one. And here's a little frog that this man gave to me. He found it on the ground, so it's a little frog. It has a pretty nice action to it, actually. And this is another popper. I got it stuck in my shorts, so it has that on it, but I've caught in Probably of like 50 bass on this thing. Teeth marks everywhere. And then I found this wall popper in the water. Um, one of the hooks is broken on it. I have not used this yet either. And here's this white waffle popper. Uh, and here's a pop popping frog right here. Haven't caught any fish on it. I haven't even used it yet. Um, I cut these tails too short, but um, I have caught a few fish on this walking frog here. Okay, guys. Next, I'm gonna do um my chatterbaits and jigs. I only have like three chatterbaits and two jigs. First, we're gonna go with this brown football jig right here. Have I caught any fish on this yet? I haven't really even used it either. This is my black and blue jig right here and it has one like crawl trailer on here. And then chatterbait. So I have two of these colors. They're stuck together. Uh, so here's one. It's like, yeah, okay. 
That's one. And then here is the other. Taunting fish on both of them. And here's this white one right here. And then jig heads, I have like this bone jig head. I have this regular jig head right here. And then this like grayish jig head. It's like a football jig head. Okay, next we're gonna go to uh, spinner baits. Uh, I don't have that many spinner baits, I do need to restock. Uh, here's just this plain white, like, crappy spinner bait, super little. There's another plain white, crappy little spinner bait. I haven't even caught any crappy on it, it's just caught in bass. And here's this big shad pad, it's just one bait. I have caught in a few fish on this. Nothing big. I think the biggest fish I've caught on that is, uh, two pounder, uh, surprisingly. So next I'm gonna go to, uh, like hooks and uh, like bullet weights. So I have these circle hooks here for catfish. And I have used them for some bass too. I mean, not used them, I've caught in some bass on it. Some worm hooks here. And then I have these like gold hooks right here. I don't know, they're in my grandfather's ta tackle box. He let me have them. And my dad said they're for catfish. Um, but his, this is what they look like. And then here's another catfish hook here. And then some Ned rigs. And then the other side is bullet weights, so let's get to that. Uh, bullet weights, here's a smaller version. And then here's a bigger version of bullet weights, so. Yeah, it's all my uh, uh, tackle boxes. Now let's get to worms. Wait, can't forget about that goat catfish bait. They're just a big pile of all my worms. Uh, first off, here's a um, Zoom Old Monster Green Pumpkin Worms right here. And then we have like this, uh, I think it's a Bullfrog. Yeah, a Chick Worm, uh, the original Chick Worm, Bullfrog color from Zoom. Another Zoom bait, this is a Chick Worm, Watermelon Red. And we got this really old uh, power bait here. Oh, uh, this is an electric blue. And I... It's not closed. Oh, yeah. That's also for my grandfather's tackle box. And then here's these uh, worms. I forgot what they're called, but I have cut a few fish from these. Got the color. I know they're from Zoom, though, so. And here's some Guggen trench hogs right here. The color is black and blue. And then I have these missile baits here. There are, this is red bug candy. Haven't got any fish on that yet though. Here are those missile baits are good though. Here's another power bait, really old. That's a black shad. Okay, that one is also not close. Oh, and then here's another zoom. Black sapphire right here. I've caught a lot of fish in that. And then this is the bruised banana chip one. Y'all might think this is bad, but it actually is pretty good. Now here we got some shad delicious. No, it's not a worm, but it is like a soft plastic so And then last one here, yum dinga sinker green pumpkin and original and then i also have this big buzz bait right here I haven't taken it out of the package and then of course i got some bobbers i have another pack now we're going to show you my crappie and panfish soft plastics a big pile of some panfish uh 
some plastics. First here we got a Mr. Copy by Shad King, um, um, at Strike King. Last one right here. This is a Mr. Copy Scissor Shad Body. Shiny honey. Uh, I have gotten a uh, good amount of bluegill on this. And then I have this Mr. Copy uh, uh, Strike King. Shad wool, refrigerated, refrigerated white. Have caught in a lot of fish on this too. And I have this yum grub here, white, pure white. And then I have another one. This is the Christmas tree. Have caught in a good amount of fish on this too. Next, the moon glow, Bobby Garland. This is the blue ghost. Have caught a good amount of fish on this too. The yum green pumpkin. Another yum. This is the sushis. And the big baits right here. This is just red with the sushis whale um it tail. Um. Then we got this swell tail. Just a tricolor, black, blue, short fit. I don't know what that says. And I think this is another Bobby Garland. Yep. And this is a blue ice. Okay, guys. So I hope you like the video. If you're new, um, please like the video and subscribe. P turn on the post notifications so y'all see when another new video comes out. Thank you for watching. Peace.